This is how you make the most amazing, spectacular, delicious, and historical gumbo ever. Did you know that gumbo is not originally from Louisiana? If you thought Africa, you are correct. West Africa to be specific. To make gumbo, dating to at least the 19th century, West Africans used their native vegetable, okra, as a main ingredient to keep it nice and thick with a Q and give it body with a W. The name comes from the West African word quingumbo for okra, but the meal itself is a fusion of three cultures, West African, European, and Native American. Now how did it get to Louisiana, you ask? With the huge influx of enslaved African people, brought to the French colonies around Louisiana, within two years, over half of the residents of New Orleans were of African descent. Unlike other Southern delicacies we know and love, gumbo had a quite bougie beginning. It was made with the best and freshest ingredients by slaves for their owners, making it a complex representative of Black America's cultural lineage, with flavors that have marinated over history to fill our stomachs today.